Good morning, guys. I'm a state certified instructor. I teach teens and adults. I teach driver's education. Today, we're going to go over some of the most common beginning driver mistakes that will cause you to struggle and learn how to drive. Let's go ahead and get it. Listen up. These are some of the most common mistakes that you need to learn to avoid, that you need to learn at your beginning levels of driving. Let's go ahead and get into it improper lane changes. A lot of beginning drivers put their foot on a brake or slow down when they make lane changes. This causes you to lose speed and actually hold up the flow of the traffic. When you're making lane changes, it's mirror, turn signal, blind spot. Check that blind spot. Next, let's talk about changing lanes and intersections. Driving is a learned skill set. And if you learn the wrong way, it's gonna be a big struggle for you to learn the right way. Avoid changing lanes in intersections. It's dangerous and it's illegal. So avoid doing that. Change lanes before the intersection or after the intersection. Have it in your mind where you wanna go and what you wanna do. Next. Not keeping both hands on the wheel. Your hands belong at 9 and 3 or 10 and 2. Not 12 and 6, not 4 and 7, not 11 and 1. Have your hands balanced on both sides because you want to balance the car and have good control. You want to show your driver's ed instructor, your road tester, your parents, your significant other that you have good control of your vehicle. Next, confusion at four-way stops. The first car to get there is the first car to leave. You always want to have great control of your vehicle and look at drivers. Make eye contact. That's the beginning thing that I see is teaching teens and adults. Next, let's talk about forgetting to use your turn signal. 100 feet, a half a block, is when you use your turn signal. You gotta let people know that you are turning. If you turn it on too early, you're gonna confuse drivers. You turn it on too late, you will get rear-ended and then have an abrupt stop. You wanna be consistent. Next, let's talk about complete stops. You must remain motionless for three seconds. Count with me, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003. After you remain motionless, then you're free to go. No rolling stops. That's the easy way to struggle when you're learning how to drive. That's the bad habit you're gonna learn and take that into your road test and fail your road test. Let's keep going. Next, let's talk about distracted driving. The world is full of distractions. Your significant other's calling you. Your mom, where are you? Your dad, uh, I need you home. You want to minimize your distractions and stay focused on the most important task. That is driving. Be consistent, be safe, and be aware of what's going on. Take your time. Minimize those distractions. Let's continue. Lack of speed control. I see a lot of beginning drivers. Remember, I teach teens and adults. They're going five to seven under the limit five to seven over the limit. You have to have great speed control to help you have balance. You wanna be safe and consistent. You need to drive at the speed limit. If drivers are going five, seven, 10, 12 over, you as a beginning driver cannot do that. You have to have great speed control. You have to learn great speed control, okay? Let's continue. Driving too slow, they go hand in hand. Beginner drivers drive five to seven under the limit. You don't know it, but you're frustrating other drivers. You're making them mad. Hey, what are you doing? You've got to go at the speed limit. You got to check your speed limit. Look for those signs. Check the speedometer and look ahead. Just like I'm looking ahead right now. Look ahead. Occasionally check your speedometer, but look ahead is so important. Next, driving too fast for the conditions on the road. It is minus 25 where I am. It's very cold. If you're driving too fast, you're gonna have black ice. That is ice that you can't see. 
you as a driver have to be aware of those conditions and avoid that type of condition where you're going over speed. You do not want to go over speed in dangerous conditions. Many states or provinces have something called the basic speed law. You must drive at a speed that is safe and reasonable for the conditions on the road. You need to drive safely. Braking too hard. Oh my God. So many times I'm in the vehicle with teens and adults and they're slamming the brake. You'll lunge forward. You'll lose control. You have the potential to get rear-ended. You could slam into another car. Don't slam your brake. Slow down easily. Use your right foot only. Have thin sole shoes on. Use the ball of your foot on the brake. Squeeze the brake. Don't lunge forward. You'll lose control of the car. Not checking mirrors. You as a beginning driver, every 12 to 15 seconds, check that center mirror. Check your driver's side mirror. Check your left mirror. Know who's around you. Team, if this brought you value and you made it to end, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. I love you and appreciate you. Bye.